Hey YouTube, what's going on? It's me, Jessica, um, aka Honeybee1226, and I am back again with another half wig review, okay? And, um, I was going to do a tutorial, but today is Mother's Day, and we were really in a rush this morning, so I really didn't have time to, like, you know, even sit down and do that thought. I just, we just came back in. That's why I said, okay, let me do a half a review. And happy Mother's Day to all the mommies out there. Even if you don't have any kids, but if you can take care of kids or your teacher, happy Mother's Day. So, um, but this wig, I like her a lot. This is Monica by Altry. And, um, I, today's actually the first day I'm wearing her. So, and she doesn't look too different from the picture. So, this is what she looks like in the picture. This is um, Monica Altry, and this is a 1D33. This is a S1D33. So, you probably can't see the highlights in it, but when, you know, in person, you can see it very, very well. And it's really nice. So, um, basically, once you've seen one, one of my tutorials, you pretty much see them all. The preparation for this particular wig is pretty much the same for a lot of the wigs I've done. Um, <coughs> I mean, it's not the same for every single wig, but with this one, um, same thing, parting my hair in the front, like right up to the ears, because I do, you know, I, I take all my hair in the front, some people just take out the bang, but um, I took all the hair out in the front, um, you know, put it back in the ponytail, use this size curl and iron, and curl the front, and it actually blended in perfectly um, with the wig, and um, I used a headband. As you can see, I put a headband in the front. At first, I didn't have a headband on. I was like, okay, it's okay. But then once I put the, um, the headband on, I was like, okay, I really like the way it looks on. So, um, I actually ordered this wig a few weeks ago. When, was it? No, it was actually more than that. I ordered it when I was on maternity leave um, from Hair with Harlem. And I paid $16.99 for it at the time. Um, it's actually cheaper now. If you go to Hair with Harlem now, it's actually fourteen ninety nine because if you if you shop on here with Harlem frequently, you'll know that you'll notice that they have some outre wigs. A lot, a, a majority of the outre wigs have been on sale for fourteen ninety nine for I would say for the past month now. So, um, but I think the catch with that is that the colors are limited. But I went back on there and it seems like they actually have the colors now, like any color you want. That's what it seems like. So, um. If you go to Hair with Harlem, you'll get the Monica wig for fourteen ninety nine, which is better because if you go to other websites, you're not going to get that cheap. Other websites probably have it for um probably you know seventeen, eighteen, nineteen dollars. So, but anyway, this is how she looks, and it's a really nice um you know kind of loose curl wig. And um like I said, with her, all I really did I, when I put her on, I just finger combed her, you know, finger combed her a lot. And like I said, with this particular wig, you have to finger comb her because if you don't, it's like kind of a tight curl. So once you finger comb her, she looks a whole lot better. So, and let me turn around and show you how she looks. Um, this is how it looks in the back. And back to the front. So, I wore it for Mother's Day and I got a lot of compliments on her. And I just love her so much. And it really was easy to blend. I haven't permed my hair probably about um, a month and a half or so. And um, I just washed my hair last night and roller set in and then I blew dry out the curls and I wrapped it overnight until this morning I just kind of took it out. So actually my hair is actually laying down real nice and I used, um, <coughs> with my regular hair, I used this, which is really good, the Optimal Oil um, Therapy Shine Booster. But I say you don't want your hair to be dry and then try to blend it in with this wig. So you want to at least kind of condition your own hair first. So I used the Optimum Oil Therapy Shine Booster and then I just curled it and blended it in with the wig and of course with this one I used, I have been using the um, the Cutie Glaze but this one I did use the Black and Sassy and it lays down really well. I think I'm going to go back to buying her more often buying the Black and Sassy because I've been using the um, the Cutie Glaze for quite some time. So. But anyway, I hope you like her. Please leave some comments and let me know what you think. But Monica seems to really be pretty popular. I mean, I've watched some other girls' videos. And honestly, that's the reason I even bought this wig, because of watching other videos. And honestly, that's really the great thing. I don't, you know, 
about you know making these videos and I just want to thank all my subscribers because you know a lot of times if you want to buy a wig a lot of people might think oh who cares it's just a wig but honestly you know as I said in my last video when I um do you know do my wig shopping even if I see a wig that I like I'm not gonna just you know go and um just buy it you know unless I you know really really you know look at the model and say okay but for the most part I'm gonna go back to YouTube and I'm going to look at other girls' videos and see how it looks on them. That's how I decide what wig I'm going to buy. So, because I've seen some people leave comments in other videos about what's the point of the halfway video. But like I said, a lot of people enjoy watching the videos because it gives them an opportunity to see how the wig looks on another person. And this particular wig, I've seen almost every wig I have, I've watched videos from, of other girls wearing the, vid the wig. And they and it, if it looks good on them, I'm like, okay, well, it probably would look good on me. You know, and you, you so that, that's how you make a decision. So... Um, and that's pretty much it. And if you are wondering about these earrings, um, these you probably could find these anywhere. But these particular wig, um, um, earrings, I bought. It's like a, it's like a earring that like has some circles on it. Um, the reason I bought them because if you watch Basketball Wives, it actually reminded me of the earrings that they that um, Evelyn wears on Basketball Wives. So that's the reason I bought it. And I got it in this little novelty store. It was like a kind of a I can't describe it was like kind of like a little earthy type store. They sell incense and all type of different stuff. But they were selling for like three dollars and I got it at Discovery Mills Mall down in it, here in Atlanta. But I'm sure anywhere you go, I've been to beauty supply stores. Those are like accessory stores. You can get earrings like this like really, really cheap. You know, some I don't always wear like my my real good jewelry I do for the most part but sometimes you know you want just a different look and I thought these were really cute and it really looked like the the earrings that that girl wears from the show so that was basically it and also I know we don't talk about the clothes that I wear but this dress that I'm wearing I got this dress from Nordstrom Rack it's a maxi dress and I got this dress from Nordstrom. I know you guys can see my little rolls. I'm still working out. But I got this dress from um, Nordstrom Rack. At, um, if you live in Atlanta, they have one down at, like, in Nordstrom Hotel. And I paid $18 for it. So there are some stores that they like. It's because I'm a bargain shopper. I love going to places like Marshalls and Ross and, and stuff like that. But there's some stores that I would not normally even... Um, shop at Nordstrom because the prices are so high but and, I'm, and they have stuff that I know I could get at Marshalls or whatever cheaper but when I went to Nordstrom right they were having like a major sale because they already reduced the prices it's like a discount at Nordstrom and they were having a sale for an additional 40% off so you never know so some of those stores you can check out because sometimes they have sales and they really reduce prices so but anyway I gotta go um thank you for watching my video please subscribe rate comment and um let me know what you how you feel about the wig and um I'll See you next time I'm going to do my next video. I know I should have done some more because I've been wearing wigs all week. But I just haven't really had time. But, um, I will, um, I have another, some other wig videos I'm hoping that I can get done this week. So, anyway, thank you for watching. God bless and see you next time.